Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about setting up cPanel with GitHub for automatic deployment. And we what we want to do is, as we publish into the master branch, we want to pull that information into our, uh, our cPanel. And we will be doing this with FTPs, uh, FTP accounts. So the first thing we want to do, I'm going to create my GitHub repo. And I'm going to call this, and this is going to be a private repo, right? I'm going to call this uh, GitHub cPanel sample and private repo let's create the repository and from there what i want to do is i want to set up our ftps on cpanel so let's go into cpanel i already have my account here logged in i'm going to look for ftp accounts okay and i'm going to create a new account so i'm going to call this uh let's say uh ftp git sample okay i'm going to generate a password Perfect. I'm going to put a limit in it. I'm going to put it under this folder rather than FTP git sample. Let's create the account. And now we have that account. So once we have that account, what we need to do is we need to set up those secrets on the GitHub cPanel. So what we'll do here is we're going to go to settings and we'll go to secrets. And this is where we will add our secrets that we will be using, which are the FTP server, username, and password. So let me create that secret. The first one I'll do is FTP server. And I'm going to put the value here. You're going to put your value there. I'm going to create another secret for the FTP password. And then I'm going to create another secret for the FTP username. And let's go grab that username from here, FTP git sample. Perfect. All right. So now we have that set up and we want to set up an action. So once we have the secrets, we're going to go to actions. Okay. And we're going to create a set up a workflow yourself. And I'm going to call this deploy cpanel. Okay. And you're going to copy this code that I'm going to add within the within the the blog post and you're gonna put, change this to main usually my branch is main or put whatever branch you are and you have the secrets ftp user ftp server username password i'm gonna commit okay and that creates a folder inside your repo so now we have that we have the workflows. I'm going to set up this in my desktop. Then I'm going to commit a file. So I added that into my, uh, my repo here and I'm going to commit a file. Let's create a new file called index index.php and we're going to call this echo hello world let's save it and let's publish into git let's push this up to the repo and then let's check our ftp account that file that folder to make sure that it pushed it to the correct folder uh, it to the main branch okay let's make sure our, our repository is updated it just got updated so now let's go into the file manager just make sure that that got uh, added into our folder which was ftp git sample and let's see if we see on a uh, on our workflow, the file is still being added into the server. So let's refresh. And uh, and once once it gets added, let's refresh cPanel, and we have our index file in there. So that's how to set up automatic deployment on GitHub for your repository. I mean, on cPanel for your repository. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments below. And also make sure to follow us and subscribe.